Hello, in this video we're going to do a perfect competition problem when presented with a production function. So here's a setup. We have a perfectly competitive firm producing eggs. Uh, the firm has a production function for eggs given by the following formula. E is the number of eggs. F is the input in producing eggs, units of feed. And eggs sell in a perfectly competitive market for 30 cents each. The cost of the input, the cost of a unit of feed, is 10 cents. So what is a profit maximizing number of eggs to produce? So we'll set up the profit function. Total revenue minus total cost. Total revenue is the price of eggs. A competitive firm takes the price as a given. So that's going to be just 30 cents. E will be the number of eggs. And then we're going to subtract out the total cost here uh, minus the price of feed times units of feed. So making our substitutions, 0.3 is the price, E is the number of eggs, 0.1 is the price of the input times F units of the input. We're going to take a derivative of the profit function, uh, but before we do that we need to make one substitution. Uh, for this E here I am going to substitute now in the production function. So substituting in the production function for E, we have a profit function uh, as a function of one choice variable F. So we're going to take the derivative of profit with respect to F units of feed. So doing that, we get the following result. And you'll note I set this derivative equal to zero trying to maximize here. So uh, we bring the 3 fourths down in front. So 3 fourths times 4 thirds is just 1. So that all disappears. And then 3 fourths minus 1 in the exponent leaves us with f raised to the minus 1 fourth power. And then finally the derivative of minus 0.1 f is just minus 0.1. Moving this on to the next screen here, rewriting the results, moving the 0.1 over to the right hand side. Following the rules of exponents, bringing this f to the minus 1 fourth down into the denominator. Dividing through by 0.1, so 0.3 divided by 0.1 is just 3. And then multiplying everything through by f to the 1 fourth power, we get this result. Going to raise both sides to the power of 4, so f to the 1 fourth raised to the 4th power is just f, and then 3 raised to the power of 4 is just 81. We're going to take this 81 and plug it into the production function to get the profit maximizing number of eggs, or 36. Uh, before I go, I just want to show you that you know one of the things that's dropping out of the first order condition is this notion that the optimal use of an input will be given by this condition price of the uh, the the output price the price of eggs times the marginal product of the input equals the input price and so you see that right here 0.3 is the price f is the marginal product of the input and the input price is 10 cents so basically we got the marginal benefit here on the uh, left hand side and then we got the marginal cost of the input on the right hand side and so we do something up into the point where the marginal benefit just equals mar the marginal cost in order to maximize. Alright, that's it. I hope you found this video helpful.